How hard is it just to get up in the morning and, and deal with uh, so much negative press and perhaps uh, some doomsayers as well? I don't. It doesn't bother me a bit. I am, uh, I'm a grinder. I, uh, I wake up, I eat a few nails before I have breakfast. I campaign hard and I campaign with joy. Nails for breakfast. Tasty. New this morning, KSBW's parent company, Hearst Television, launching a new half-hour interview and discussion program this weekend, and that was a clip from the weekly show, Matter of Fact, hosted by noted political commentator, Fernando Escuelas. We are fortunate to have Fernando join us this morning, live from our Hearst Washington newsroom, to talk more about what we can expect to see from the show. Good morning, Fernando. Good morning, Dale. Fernando, as we saw in the clip, you got the chance to speak with Jeb Bush, and as you've been preparing for the launch, who else have you interviewed, and what did they say that we, we may not have heard before? Well, I also spoke to Bernie Sanders, uh, both in the case of uh, Governor Bush and the senator from Vermont. Uh, my approach has been to ask uh, questions that go beyond just the talking points and really press them on the details of what they plan to do. Uh, the whole concept of the show and why it's called Matter of Fact is because we really are trying to get to objective reality as opposed to ideology or slogans. And so uh, the interviews are a little different. They're unscripted as well. Uh, so it makes I, perhaps for uh, surprises, both for the guests and, and hopefully for the audience. Well, they'll try to bring their talking points anyway, as we both know. Fernando, who are some of the people we can see on the premiere this Sunday? Well, it, it will be Jeb Bush and Bernie Sanders. Uh, we have uh, uh, really top names in the following shows. We expect to have those big names that people want to hear from uh, throughout the program. And also people that perhaps uh, are not famous but are real experts in certain matters that are of importance to Americans. Uh, this is the whole concept of the show, which is really to go uh, into depth uh, so that people have uh, a sense of, of reality, a sense of uh, how the country is being run or, or badly run in some cases, and how to inform yourself so that when you are voting next year or in the primaries, uh, of course, uh, you will have all the information you need to make the right choice for you, your family, and the country. All right, a little bit more on that, if you would, Fernando. What exactly would make this more unique from other political talk shows? Well, I, I think uh, uh, the overarching concept of the show is, is not to uh, focus on the inside the beltway, inside Washington chatter, and, and basically have a conversation that it feels a little bit private. And, uh, and, and I think that turns a lot of people off from politics. They think they can't uh, penetrate that, that kind of talk. And, and they're right. Uh, a lot of the media coverage is, is not that transparent, not that interesting, <laughs> if I can say that. So I think uh, when you think about politics and and put it through a very basic filter of uh, it's the coming together of money fame and power it's a very human story and that's what we want to tell tell it from the human perspective and and be able to evaluate it as I said earlier through some sort of empirical lens got it trying to uh, trying to cure folks of that Potomac fever that hits so often thank you Fernando live from our Hearst Washington newsroom this morning if you want to hear more from Fernando and all of his guests be sure to tune in to matter of fact with Fernando Escuelas at 10 a.m. Sundays on Central Coast ABC.